Hello guys and gals, welcome to one how to smartphones tutorial videos on the Google Pixel 3. In this video I'll be showing you guys how to add a fingerprint to the Pixel 3 to help you unlock your device or do any kind of online purchases and things like that. So first thing what we're going to want to do is start off by going into our settings, which is the gear looking function. Go ahead and select that. And once you are in here, go ahead and scroll down till you find all of your security uh, and location. So go ahead and select that. And once you are here, we're going to go ahead and slide down here to where it says Pixel Imprint. Go ahead and select that. And from here, it's saying um, the capabilities that will, you will be able to do with your fingerprint. So unlock with Pixel Imprint. Pixel Imprint uses your fingerprint to wake and unlock your phone, authorize purchases, or sign um, into apps. And um, then it says be careful who whose fingerprint you add. They will also be able to do all of these things. Going to go ahead and hit next, and then it's going to ask for a backup um, form if the imprint for whatever reason does not work. So let's just go ahead and use a pin. And now we just got to set up our pin one, two, three, four. Very simple um, pin that I use for just demonstration purposes. I recommend getting a stronger one if you're going to be using a pin. And then here it's going to ask you how you want your notifications to be shown show all notification content, hide sensitive content or don't show anything at all. I'm just gonna go with the default one. And then from here it says, um, touch the sensor. It's on the back of your phone. Use your index finger. So I'm just gonna go ahead and start off by pressing on it. You'll feel a little vibration. I'll move your finger up and down as you go. I'll move it around to the sides, different areas of the device. And I strongly recommend using a clean finger. Make sure your finger is clean, whatever one you're gonna use. Um, to set as a fingerprint password and also make sure the back of the device where you are placing your finger is clean as well to get the best results. So here it says fingerprint has been added. Um, when you see this icon, use your fingerprint for identification or approval of purchases. Um, if you see that icon, go ahead and use that. So just like that, your fingerprint has been set and it has been um, um, by default set as one of your ways to get into your device. So at the beginning of the video, you guys saw me swipe up and I got into my device. Now it's asking for a pin, and that's the pin that we set up. Or you can use the back of the um, back where we set up our fingerprint. And I just like that, it scanned me in and opened up the device to let me in. Um, so if that's how to set up the fingerprint, let's say you wanted to remove it. What we're going to want to do is go back into settings, go back into your security and location. And then right down here, it says uh, pixel imprint. Go ahead, select that. It's going to ask you for that code that you set up previously. Uh, one, two, three, four is what I set up. And I'm going to hit go. And just like that, we see the fingerprint. If you wanted to add a secondary fingerprint, you can add it down there. If you want to get rid of the one you have, go ahead and get rid of it with the trash can logo and remove your fingerprint. And just like that, your fingerprint is gone. So your fingerprint is gone, but you still have your passcode lock on there, the one that we set the pin of 111. I'm just going to show you guys here, 1, 2, 3, 4. Um, it is still on the device. If you guys want to get rid of that as well, to get rid of any kind of um, any kind of security that you guys had on there, including the pixel imprint, go ahead back, head back into settings. Um, if you guys scroll down here, you guys will see the screen lock is set to pin. Go ahead and select that. It's going to ask to verify your passcode. And we will do that now. And then you can set to none or swipe. I recommend swipe just because um, it is easy. And with none, your phone constantly pocket dials people and stuff like that. So I like to swipe one. It's just all you do is swipe and it takes you right back in the, into your device. So that, that is how to add your fingerprint on the Google Pixel 3. How to add it and take it off as well. Um, if you guys found this video helpful, be sure to give it a thumbs up. If you guys know anybody who is searching for this information, please do pass it on to them. And that's all I got for you guys in this one. If you guys like to see other helpful tips and tricks on the Pixel 3, go ahead and check out that playlist in the description below. That's all I got for you guys in this one. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day. Peace.